Hello everybody, we're rolling crazy. Alright, today I'm going to be showing you people at home how to do scented loom bands. It's easy, but it takes like half an hour. People say two hours, but it doesn't. I'm not going to be showing you bracelets, I'm going to be showing you bands. Oh yeah, here's my scented ones I've bought. another packet yeah I've got four packets now um, I'm going to be showing you uh, this packet here this one's that I'm selling so I am not doing full bands like this but I might do this one to show you and yeah these in there as well they're bumpy Right, um, we got to go into the kitchen to get stuff. I'm just warning you to. I'm just warning you guys. I'm sorry about the mess, okay? See my doggy? His name's Bobby. He pulled up the flooring, by the way. I'm going to go in this cupboard here to get the M&M bowl. Bowl. The M&M bowl that we all use. But I need to just give it a rinse out quick because it's got a bit dusty. Um, here's my sink. I'm just going to set you guys up right here so you can see my bowl that I'm mixing out. And then just give it, give it a quick dry. Shake it around a bit. This isn't what you need to make your loom band centered. It's because I can't. My bowl was just dirty a bit. Not dirty like food in it, it was dusty. It's just cleaner. What we need is like warm water, but not hot water. So my warm tap's going on. That's it. need a bit though, so if it gets warm, just let some cold water in. And if it gets too hot, sorry. That's fine. I need a fork and a spoon. Here's the fork. Put that on there. Here is our cutlery drawer. It's very jam-packed. And here is a spoon. Yeah, they're two different designs because me and my dad prefer these ones and my mum prefer those ones. So, yeah. Need a clean tea towel as well, so. Second drawer down. Move that back over. Put that on my arm. Alright, we are ready to start. Making some alley loom bands. The reason why we have a stair gate is because the dog like attacks everything. He'll chew everything if you don't put it there. Yeah, oh, my floor's a bit messy. Right, just sit back down here with my loom band stuff. You need a smell that you're doing. My smell is going to be it isn't what it says on the packet but it is actually cocoa and vanilla I put it in there so then I can hang it out when I'm having a bath I think my dog wants to go out so I'm just going to try let him out okay put that back up there so he can't knock it over come on then Ozzy see he wants to go out Right, I am going to try making it before the dog jumps in the door. Don't worry if he does, I'll just get him in quick and we'll carry on from where we were. Let's sit back down. Right, what you want to do, I'm going to just set that up in between my legs. One sec.
You want to put, oh, get that hair out, the dog hair. Right, get this spoon. Tablespoon. This is, open up if it's going to let you. Click it back. Right, I'm going to put the tea towel down because it does get a bit messy here. Alright, with this spoon, you can see it. We're going to score some on. And it like covers the whole thing and just chuck it into the water. And then just mix it in. It needs to be a good smell though. Okay, that's a good smell, sorry. I'm looking it over. Look, mine's gone back there. There's still some on this spoon, so just try getting that off. Okay, I'm just going to smell it again. Yeah, that smells lovely. I'm going to show you how to do it with a new man first. Right, take the spoon out. You put it into the water, get the fork, hang on, I'll show you now, you'll start seeing bubbles come through, that means it's all getting into it, and you keep turning it over, and just keep doing it. And then you just get it out and see if it smells like it yet, if you want to keep it in there for longer. Hang on, I just gotta put this back down because I'm not 100% sure if that's right or not. Okay, that's all right. Now let me just dry it first and I'm gonna see if it's actually worked because it might just be the water that's making it smell. Right, put it back in there for a little while longer because it's not working properly. Well, it is, but it's not doing it the way we want it to happen. So I'm putting it back in and then just keep turning it over. It don't actually matter if you use your hands. Make sure your hands are clean. My hands are clean because I washed them when I was at the sink. And just separate them so they're not all of it can get in and just mix it around like that my hand smells nice where I got my body wash from um, it is from Wilkinson's one pound a bottle but um, from this here probably about that big about, oh the dog's kind of opened the door so I've got to let him in Just stick that in there and that will allow it to soak in a more higher level by the way I have had a bath that's why if you did see me anyway my hair was wet. Right. Ugh. Sitting back down. It's the third time already today. And I'm here is the band. The lean band. It will get bubbles in it, so all you do is get a fork, stick it through the holes, like so. In just a minute. Mm. 
that is now a finished product. I'm going to sell that for 20p. Right, now I am going to be doing my bag of laying bands, which will take longer and harder. So take out my S clips I've packed and my hook, my orange hook. I'm just going to put it all in there. Get the whole lot in there. That is what mine looks like. It looks like a bowl full of vomit. So there's dog hair everywhere because my dumb dog is molting a lot now. Maddie always has, so I don't know why I said now. Mix it in like what you would if you were making a cake. Just make sure everything does get in there. For here, because I'm selling these for a pound a bag, there's eight, no, 600 in the pack, sorry. Um, I've got to make sure that they're dry and everything, so they're starting to smell already. Just keep doing that. I might just add a tad more in. Yeah, sorry about that. Second time already that I've dropped the camera and put my fingers in the way. Um, a bit more. There you go, that's it, that's all I'm adding in. And then I mix it from there. It's actually only 20 past 8 where I am. So I'm in the UK, England, Peterborough, Britain. It is now starting to get really bubbly, so that is actually how close they get in there. I'm just going to smell them now. Yep, they're done. Right. Lay the tea towel out as much as you can. And then I've just laid that out quickly whilst I was mixing, so... I'm going to strain out pretty much the whole length. Right, now what you do, get your fork. Grab a hand, I'll grab as much as you can, let it drip a bit, chuck it on. Or you can just use your hands like I am starting to do. And then just rub it on there tea towel and you've done a handful. No, I'm going to use the fork and then rub it on the tea towel with my hand because I don't see the point of 